Hi, Cat's Cradle here. This was kind of an afterthought, or else I would have set up a better, uh, a better looking scene for you here. Uh, on nights when I teach piano, I come right in from school. In fact, I usually, uh, my students ride home with me from school. We just live in a little tiny town, and that's okay with the parents. And um, I teach piano lesson right after school, and then by that time, it's time for, by the time piano lessons are over, it's time for Pellet and Prepper to walk in and I need to get supper on the stove fast. So it's another soup and sandwich night, but I haven't showed you how to do this. Now, you mark my word, this will be a life-changing video for you. Am I right, Pellet and Prepper? It is. <laughs> it's going to be a life-changing video. I don't remember where we got this idea, but it's the, one of the best ideas we ever got, and we absolutely love it. We would never eat a plain grilled cheese again, and here's what we do. This is, this is pallet and prepper, so I'm going to put this over here, and all I have to do is put a little butter on it to grill it. I'm going to set it over here, actually. And here's what you do. You take your bread. We happen to like whole wheat. This is store-bought. Don't fuss at me, but it's, it was a crazy weekend. I didn't have time to make bread. So then what you do is you put you just slice your cheese. We like sharp cheddar cheese, um, and actually uh, we like the cheese that I wax best of all because it gets the most delicious flavor. So just kind of cover your bread like that. And then what you do is you take uh, chopped onion. This just happens to be purple onion, but we've done it with white onion, purple onion. It doesn't matter. And you just pile some of that on there. And then this is a quart jar. It's almost an empty quart jar of my home uh, pickled jalapeno peppers. And you just chop those up. Now, it can just be regular jalapenos. It could be canned jalapenos you get from the grocery store. It could be fresh jalapenos if you like it really hot. So these are just pickled jalapenos and um, th these are not these are not terribly hot. Oh, and I forgot to do this to his. I should do it too. Now, now here's one of the secrets to it. <clears throat> because if you try to flip this sandwich and the cheese and melt it real good, a lot of the, the uh, this chopped up stuff will fall out. So if you uh, want to, I just kind of put enough cheese on here just to kind of act like a glue here. You don't have, really have to cover it like you do the other side, but uh, <clears throat> just to work as a glue. You see how that stuff falls off? Then you put the lid on like that and press it down a little bit. Then I'm going to butter these and grill them. Oh, this is for preparation. She only wants a half and she doesn't want to do the onions and jalapenos. So I'm going to grill this and when I serve it up with my soup, we'll come back and let Paladin Prepper try it. <laughs> We know he loves it. This is the best grilled cheese ever, but we'll show you how it looks when it's cooked. Cat's Cradle here. We're back, and the grilled cheese are done, and here's some of the jalapenos and onions fall out. Just let them go ahead and kind of saute in your pan, and you can just put those on the side. I had a piece of extra uh, uh, cheddar cheese, and if you've never made a cheddar cheese cracker just with cheddar cheese. You just lay it in your hot pan, let it get brown on one side, and turn it. Oh my goodness, it's delicious. And here's kind of what the sandwich looks like on the inside. The gooey cheese, the onion, the jalapeno. Mm -mm -mm. And we've got potato soup to go with it. And there's Paladin Prepper's plate. He's about to try it. And a bowl of oranges for dessert. Now, that's a fast, delicious dinner. Go ahead and let us know what you think. Of course, I already know this is like one of his very favorite uh, sandwiches. We kind of eat it with a knife and fork. Mmm. Mmm. Sounds just I'll like tell you. Sounds just like prepper doesn't he? I'll tell you one thing. If you're somebody that really enjoys a good grilled cheese sandwich, once you eat this, you'll never go back. It's true. It's true. Give it a try. Jalapeno and onion on your cheddar cheese grilled cheese sandwich. Nice warm bowl of soup, a little bit of fresh fruit. Uh, we're using fresh oranges today because I found them on sale, a uh, four pound bag for $1.48, I believe. But uh, all of this can be a pantry meal. The meal can be homemade whole wheat bread. The cheese can be cheese that you have uh, waxed. If you haven't done that before, go look at my video on waxing cheese. You can reconstitute dehydrated onion and your own home canned jalapenos. This is August and Forms potato soup. I did a review of that. You can go look at that. I did it just uh, last week, I think. And I usually, uh, on the dinner table, have my own home canned citrus. It just so happens that 
fresh was really inexpensive this week, but I also have a video on how to can citrus. It's one of the easiest things to can. You do it in a boiling water bath, and it tastes just like fresh uh, oranges when you take it out of your jar. It's delicious. So give it a try. Uh, hope you like it, and uh, if you try it, let me know. Cat's Cradle, Trevor Ray. And Paladin Prepper. <laughs> have a good evening, y'all.